Hello, do you hear me? Nice to hear. Hello, 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 people. Everything good? Nice yes. and clear. Yes, yes, yes. Do you hear me? Nice and clear. No. Yes or no? Hello, Camilo. No, no audio. What about now? Do you hear me? Yes. No. Yes, sir. Yes. Is it better now? Juan David? Yeah, I'm a history teacher. Oh, thank you. Good evening. How are you? You good? It's nice to have you one more time. We're going to have our last class of this module, which is... Good night. Good evening. Good night, thank you so much. Nice to have you. As you may know, we have our last class of this module. So uh, section number five is the one we're going to finish. Don't forget that you have the different assignments uh, on the platform, right? I'm seeing that some of you already did it, which is wonderful. Yes, uh, very good. But if there are some that are missing, uh, go ahead and do those to get your uh, diploma. <laughs> Generally, nice to have you. Do the activities, do the assignments that you plan for. So you can get your diploma and you can uh, move on to the next module. As you may know, this is intermediate English module number one. So uh, if everything goes uh, perfect, that means you're, you're in the next one, right? But that depends on you. It depends on you, right? Um, we're going to have a little bit more of practice on today's class. Uh, thank you so much for being here on time. And this is the thing we're going to work. As you may know, in section number five, we were working a lot with a future with a will, and we will include activities that we plan for uh, future events, right? So that is the thing we are going to talk today in this class, okay? Thank you. Let's begin with two questions. I have two questions for you. Uh, these are the ones. So have you ever made any vacation plans for this year? Have you ever made any vacation plans for this year? Oh, I think that is a mistake there. Have you ever made any vacation plans for this year? Oh, it's have you made? I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm adding ever. Yeah. <laughs> have you? Have you made any vacation plans for this year? And the other question is, what are you going to do? Yeah. So I was adding ever at the in, in the question. So that that's why it was like, like, what is that ever? Doesn't make sense at all. Thank you. Sarai Martinez, good evening. Nice to have you. Please answer the question. Have you ever made any vacation plan for this year? Have you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> to be honest, no, sir. Oh, no, nothing? Related? No, just stay at oh. home. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah. Teacher, so. Because you know the time is a little bit hard. Everything is, is how do you say, Caro? I don't remember. It, it begins with X. So remember you're Expensive, X. right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why it's a little bit complicated. Have a a trip or something like that. Yes, yeah. So time is not enough, right, for you to do that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. How old are you, by the way? I'm twenty six. Oh my gosh, you should be traveling. Yeah, <laughs> you should be traveling <laughs> and enjoying this. Thing that is going a lie out. I know? don't. I don't have enough money, teacher, to do that. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. That's 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 bad. Yeah, that's yeah. That's bad. Okay. Um, but anyway, I yeah, can't complain. 
<laughs> Just to be clear, right? Okay. <laughs> Thank yeah. you so much. Be grateful for the things that we, we have. Exactly, right? Yeah, that's true. That's true. Thank you so much. I want okay. to, I would like to hear Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Hello, Jose. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm good, teacher. Sounds wonderful. Uh, please answer this question. Have you ever made Oh, Jesus. Have you made any vacation plans for this year? Yes. Yes, I have. Okay, tell me. What are you going to do? I will go to San Vicente to to my grandmother. When my, my grandmother lives there and all my family uh, go, go to San Vicente, a uh, small town. Its name is Santa Clara, and near the town, there there's a, a lake, and I learned to, to to swim there, and for that reason, all all vacation we will go out to the, uh, right there. Sounds exciting. Sounds mm -hmm. exciting. So you are going to go there. Oh, that's yeah, great. yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. Thank you so much for sharing that. Very okay. Good. Thank you. Melvin Diaz. Hello, maybe. Melvin. Can you speak? Hello. Hello, teacher. Oh, thank you so much. Very yeah. good. Same question to you. Have you have you made any vacation plans for this year? Uh yes, I have. Please, what are you going to do? Uh, actually, uh, I'm planning for the next weekend uh, go to the Pital, uh, but I don't know if the plan, uh, the plan it would be it will be possible, uh, because I I want to go, but my other friends, uh, I don't know if uh, if they, um, uh, if they can uh, can to go but um probably it, it will uh, i will go to the pital next uh next weekend on sunday and i go back uh on i'm sorry i will i will go on saturday and i will uh, and i will go back on sunday get back you will get back yeah, okay get get back for sure uh why why are you going there i'm I'm sorry can you repeat why are you going there and be um because i i love the nature uh, i love camping as well and i i want to i want to stay a great moment with my friends and I would like uh, under I I like the uh, extreme things. Sounds interesting. Thank you so much for sharing that. Okay. Yes. Yes. That's that's a lot of planning, right? That's a lot of planning. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Must uh, and also cause because it's like you you're going with somebody else, so that means you need to plan that in um, a little bit better because you are like. Yes, you're right. That's good. Thank you so much for sharing that. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, let me see. Where's yes. Um and somebody write in the chat. Okay, Lucia, thank you so much for letting me know. And let me see. Elizabeth. Elizabeth Rivas. Hello, Elizabeth. Good evening. Elizabeth, can you? Good evening, teacher. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine. Sounds great. Listen, uh, please answer this question. Have you ever made any vacation plans for this year? You still saying ever? Thank you so much, Juan. I don't know why I have that thing in my mind. In the you like that word, huh? I don't know why, but it's like, uh, <laughs> like, it, it kills me. Believe me, it kills me because I'm doing it like 
without thinking. Yeah, I'm just doing it. I'm just like saying it. And that sounds like this, the questions doesn't sound good when I use ever. So the, success, the question is, have you made any vacation plans for this year? That sounds good. But if I add ever, it sounds like, oh, but I am keep saying it and, and I'm sorry. I don't know what is happening. It's just, I think it's because it's our last class, I guess so. Yes, I guess it's because of that. So uh, I was working with, let me see. Oh, Jesus. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Thank you. Nice to have you. Welcome. Elizabeth. Where was Elizabeth? Elizabeth? I am here. To see oh, thank you so much, Elizabeth. Please, have you made any vacation plans for this year? Um... I uh, will probably um travel um to Mexico. Uh, can Where you are you me? going specifically? Like wh where are you going? Which city? What city? I don't know. Um, Guadalajara, Acapulco, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Acapulco, nice. Yeah, I remember Acapulco from La La Vecindad. Do you remember La Vecindad, the TV series? Okay, yeah. yeah, that's why I remember Acapulco. Yeah. I've never been there, but I remember Acapulco, Acapulco because of that TV series. <laughs> yes. Um. Oh, how how long are you going to stay there? Uh, maybe two weeks. Oh, look at that! You hearing that? That's amazing. Yes, I wish you the best and I hope that you can enjoy every second over there. Okay, thank you so much for sharing that. That's very nice. Okay, okay. we're going to work with this one. Look at the pictures of summer camp. What activities are the children doing and what other activities do children do at summer? Okay, so uh, I'm sorry, but the picture is in white <laughs> and black. Okay, so... Uh, uh, if, if you don't see some, that's okay. Uh, I get it. But tell me, what, what are the activities that you see here, like in the picture? Um, you, Juan de Madrid, let's begin with you. Swimmers? Swimmers? Excuse me? Swimmers? Es excuse me, can you repeat that? Uh, swim? Swimmers? Oh, okay, swimming, that is one activity. Very good. Yes. What else? The the uh, lupa. What is say in, in English, please? Lupa. Oh, L lupa. How do you say lupa in English? Yeah, I don't. I don't remember the. Anybody the knows? Yeah. Because neither do I. Neither do I. I don't remember. Okay. The, I don't the, 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 the current is exploration. The, the natural. Um, world. Um, kayak. Um, volleyball. Um, the I I don't remember what is I Santa Cuerda in English, please. Okay. Jumping. Yes, exactly. It's Very jumping good. rope. Okay, okay. It's a jumping uh, rope. Creo... Perdón, teacher, creo que estoy teniendo problemas con mi conexión. Me he cancelado el video. Yes, I remember we have ma magnifying glass. That is the way they call it, magnifying glass. That's a big name for a lupa in Spanish, right? That's too big. Magnifying. Okay, what are okay. What other... uh, the, the girls uh, uh, with the magnify, I, I watch the, the in insectos uh, have other uh, reproduction in the natural uh, camp. Thank you so much. So here we have the different activities. Thank you so much, Juan, that's very good. Okay. Um, here we have some activities, as you may see, right? Ronald Alexis, what are the activities that you do during summer? Uh, when in summer? Um, not much activities, teacher. Well, no activity. But uh, in the summer, uh, this year, I need to work. <clears throat> and 
So you you I don't focus have a, a lot of time. Just, no, I mean uh, when extra activity like 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 I don't know at least at least something that you did right. In, in, okay, in, in the uh, maybe <clears throat> maybe or, or, or USA. In the country is in summer okay. is is apoyar el maíz para entrarlo, no, o sea, los niños. That's right. That's right. Well, yes. Okay. As um, I try to answer the second question. What other activities do the children do at summer camp? For yeah. Example, I think uh, they will have a meeting night while burning marshmallow and telling uh, a scary tale, for example. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Thank you. Okay. And Ronald, excuse me. Do you have children? Yes, I have two children. Okay. Thank you. And what are the activities that they do? Activities what they do when when I when they have vacations? Oh yes, in summer, let's say. Okay. In summer, um <laughs> for now is is uh uh practically the most of the time they have a cow by the tablet or the phone. Okay, so so do, okay. Yeah, so okay. What about outdoor activities? Nothing like that? Outdoor activities, uh, uh we go to the parking, to, 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 to the park and and the uh, playground area or uh, going to eat pizza or something like that. But in our town, are not many places. I love, for, for, I for, love the way for, you mentioned the eating as an activity, right? <laughs> okay, eating pizza or ice cream. But in this town, in Berlin City, uh, we don't have uh, many places to enjoy your summer or the vacation. Oh really? That's that's not good. Yeah. Yes. See. The the close place that, that we have is uh, Alegria City and the uh, Lake Alegria or some store there. Is um, but um is just that. And is uh, Berlin City, uh, believe it or not, is a body is 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 a border town. Sorry to hear about it. Sorry to hear about it. Because cause like the options that you have are quite dangerous if you have children like like under 10 years old. What about you, Milagro, de La Paz Jimenez? Like, let's see, what are the activities that you and you, you have children, right? Yes? No, sorry. I'm oh, Jesus, I apologize, okay? Jesus. I don't know, bro. <laughs> uh, what, about, what about nephews? Do you have nephews? Um. Yes, but they, um, they uh, don't live with me. They are far away from me. Okay. What about your um, say outdoor activities that you do in summer or when you have the chance to do it? Outdoor activities. Um, I used to go running. I like um, go to buy ice cream and <laughs> to be in a Parque la familia here in Union. Watching the sea. Usa sin conchagua? Yeah, I I really love uh, to eat lobsters in Playitas Beach. <laughs> oh, yes. You I work love for that. Playitas. I so love you playitas. work for that a lot, right, Milagro? You work for that, so you, you uh, Yeah, that. sir. <laughs> <laughs> I, have, I have the money to go anywhere but i don't have somebody who go with me oh that's that's yeah. that's not good okay and how you can get one right uh so you can share all um they say uh, the time and also the love you have available just one thing i really love because alexis did the same because you were mentioned like eating as an activity right it's like oh i like to eat this and this so like like that was an activity right <laughs> a physical something yeah but <laughs> if you see the picture here we have physical activities like outdoor activities right so you can enjoy right so uh thank you so much for sharing that okay my thank pleasure you. sir that was very nice okay uh let's carry on we're gonna have these um activities that we do sometimes we're gonna complete this charge 
please help me out with this information, Sandra Asensio. Read this vocabulary, please. Then read the verbs. Thank you. Encounter or not? Continue, carry on. Uh, camping. Something exciting, long walk, a lot of hiking, some fishing, a uh, communion, condominium, on vacation, sailing lessons, a car, a swimming, a vacation. Thank you. Now read the verse, please, that we have here in this take, chart. Take, do, go, rent. Very good. Okay. So here we have uh, these verbs. We have take, do, go, and rent. So we have some vocabulary here, and we are going to relate this vocabulary based on the verse. Like, for instance, take, we have long walks. What else we can have we take? Tell me, please. Mm -hmm. What is another vocabulary that goes with take? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A car? A vacation. Vacation. Okay. Mm, a vacation. Okay. A vacation. And somebody mentioned a car, right? Yes, a car. Yeah. Take a card. A condominium. Mm. A condominium. Take a, a condom. What is what is the meaning of a condominium? Sailing lessons. Take sailing lessons. Oh, very good. Okay. What sailing lessons mean, sir? Oh, sailing like the D. Do you remember the sea? Sailing lessons. Like the sea. The things that we do at the sea. At the ocean. Okay. Sailing lessons. Yeah, very good. What about do? Do. Do something exciting, bro. Oh, very good, right? Uh, Something exciting, right? Like, very good. Something um exciting mm -hmm. yeah sailing is are the, related to the things that we do in the sea yeah uh what else do camping camping okay so i'll do camping okay that makes sense okay very good uh, what else a lot of hiking a lot of hiking no uh, do a lot of hiking uh, you mean some fishing? Yes, okay. Because I have some doubts with camping. Okay. Yeah. So remember like the verse take, do, go, rent. Okay. So go camping. Oh yeah. Yeah, you see, that makes sense, right? Go camping, right? Well, that's that's for me. I don't know. I don't know if you tell me you have got a different answer, okay? Because for me, it sounds like go camping because you need to move. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's like go swimming. It's like go swimming. Exactly. Oh, that's good. Thank you so much. You got it. Swimming, right? So you oh, you need to move so you can do that. Yeah. Some fishing. Oh, okay. Mm. So that no. is with do or with go? Do. Do. Ex exactly, exactly. Very good. Do some fish, right? Yes, very good. Mm -hmm. And rent. Um, mm -hmm. Rent. A, a car. car. A car, yes. If one, here we have rent a car. Condominium. Yes. Oh, a, a camper. Condominium. Condominium. A camper. No. 
But yes, a camper, right? What is a camper? Yes, a camper. Do sailing lessons, teacher? Oh, what what happened if, when it comes to lessons goes with classes, you know, Ronald? And we usually we take classes, so that's why we have it here, because it's okay. it's related to the to uh, lessons is related to classes. So that's that's oh, why. Okay, thank you, thank you, mm -hmm. thank you. So which ones are are missing? I think two are missing. I guess. Mm -hmm. Um, we have a vacation, and on vacation. Oh no, we have it here, right? So this one is taken already. Uh, on vacation and a lot of hiking. Go on vacation. And what's the verb? Go. Do a lot of hiking. Do a lot of hiking, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so these are like the verbs, and these are the things that we are that are related to uh, according to the verbs, all right? So uh, when it comes to which words or phrases go with verbs, so when somebody asks you, okay, uh, what are you going to do on, on this vacation? So you can have this bunch of options, yes, uh, to communicate what are you going to do or the way you will do it right so for example if you want to travel to i don't know to la union let's say and and, and if you don't have a car but you want to go there by car so you can say oh i'm going to rent a car yeah. okay now if you want to stay there what are you going to ask what, what do you need there right are you going to like uh do camping or are you going to rent, uh, I don't know, a camper, right? Or you are going to stay in a condominium as well, right? Um, yes. So we can use these ones. Something exciting is, is in general, right? Okay, I will do something exciting. And then you, that means that you will do other things, okay? Uh, sun fishing. Do we do this in El Salvador, like sun fishing? Um Ingrid, Maricela, do we do this one, sun fishing, or a lot of hiking? Do we do these activities here in El Salvador? Excuse me. Hello? Ingrid, I think your mic doesn't work because I don't, I don't hear you. Yeah. Nothing comes. I don't know if the rest of your class may hear your voice. Yeah, yes, I can hear. You have an issue, teacher. Your computer is discriminated. There is, um, I don't know why this computer does that thing. We just want a student. I mean, the computer picks a random student and- Your computer is thing. national social. Yeah, I'm sorry. Let me Let me try. Let me try with Ana Be Beatriz Martinez. Hello, Ana Beatriz Martinez. Hello, Fisher. You see, I hear your voice. You see, I hear your voice. You're nice and <laughs> I, I don't know why. I, yes, so I, yes. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm happy it, to say for me. Yeah, I'm sorry, but I, I hear Ana, so. Y eso que su computadora what... selectivamente cada día dice, a este no voy a escuchar ahora. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it does the thing. Okay, I was asking her, like, Sun fishing and a lot of hiking. Do we do this thing here in El Salvador? Yes. I I have some friends that do uh life uh, practice this uh, uh okay, activities, right? Activities, yes. okay. Mm -hmm. Do you know some places where we can do this? No, but my son, uh, just to, uh, to uh, go to the uh, hi uh, hi hiking. Yes, but yeah, but where? Where was uh, that? 
Uh, I, I I don't I don't remember what is the place that he, he went, but he he practiced. He likes to do hiking. So he's still doing it, right? Yes. Okay, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. What about what about what about swimming, uh, Sandra Asensio? Can you swim? I don't can swim. Oh, so you can't? Oh, no. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. There was one classmate that I was saying that he's good at swimming, right? I think that was I think that was Melvin, I guess. Okay, confirm me if I'm wrong, but he was saying that he was good at swimming. What about you, Carmelo? Can you swim? What about me? What? <laughs> Can you swim? I I was swimming like a fish in the water. <laughs> oh. I know how to swim. <laughs> <laughs> I know how to swim. I learned when I was like uh, eight years old. Oh, you were little. You were like yeah. My, my father used to uh, used to give me some classes because she knows how to swim too. And she and uh, we have four. I have three brothers, and my father teach us how to swim. So the four of, of of all we know how to swim. We learn how to swim. Oh, that's really nice to hear that. Yeah. yeah. So he mm -hmm. taught you that. That's fantastic. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but then at the end, <laughs> yeah, swim or you die, man. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> The, he was trying to get rid of rid of you, okay? He was trying to get rid of you. <laughs> but right. he, he couldn't do it. He couldn't do it, okay? Yeah. <laughs> I, just... think it, I, I think I think hiking is not so popular uh, in El Salvador, you know? Not too many people do hiking. But it became to be popular right now because that tour is a lot of tourists. They are showing the people in El Salvador how to make hiking. Oh yes, that's true. And also fishing, as far as I know, is mm. fishing is not a sport here in El Salvador. It's, it's yeah, like they it do it for a living. Yeah. You know what I mean? They go, yeah, yeah, they yeah just for living. And they eat the uh the fish, right? That's what they do. It's like yeah. um, not like in in other countries, like they go, they fish, and then mm. they just, mm. like uh, put it away. But here, we do it I, I have a story. I have oh, a story tell me, about please. the swimming. Yes. When I was 15 years old, <laughs> I <was> drowning. <laughs> and since I came to to do, no puedo hacerlo de dos. Jesus, Jesus, oh, that's a lot. That's the most of the people learn how to swim in a swimming pool. I, I am scared when I into the swimming pool. What about going to the psychologist? Maybe that that person could help you with that. that yeah, you know. Yeah. Pool in, in, in the Magico Gonzalez. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, or you can the do city like my hall, do that to the us. city hall. The the city hall. They they give like free courses of swimming. Yeah, yes, so you can a get free a free option of the, mm -hmm. the you can get, Yes, you can get a bunch of videos, <laughs> but at the end it's like oh, that's that's an extra, right? That's a plus that they give you. Give me a minute, please. I need to take the attendance. When you hear your beautiful name, please say free send or am here. <laughs> yeah. okay. Oh, yes, a bunch of like experiences. When it comes to swimming, we have different stories, right? Like, um, and some of them are like somehow difficult to, to remember, and some of them are like, oh, yes. good. Yes. yes. I, I, I did learn like in an easy way, but. Uh, swimming or die in my case uh, my father has launched me in the pool the the chorros <laughs> yeah that was i remember cool. i remember this i i i i i, I swimming with we uh like the dog <laughs> oh the, the the basic that's the basic right the basic it's a vapor <laughs> <laughs> okay thank you so much Alvaro Camilo uh, Rivera Romero. Present teacher. Thank you so much. It's nice to have you. Uh, Ana Beatriz Martinez de Lopez. Hello, teacher. 
Thank you so much and welcome. Cesar Alejandro Aparicio Mendoza. Hello, Cesar. No, he isn't. What about that win? Closely Blanco al Fares. No, he isn't. Tell me, Elizabeth Amaya Bonilla. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Efraín Emilio Acevedo. No, he isn't. What about Stephanie Saraí? Here, teacher. Thank you so much. Franklin Aristides Magaña. No, he isn't. Geraldine Lisette Villeda. Present Thank you, Geraldine. Good evening. Nice to have you. Heather Virginia Tobar Galeas. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Thank you so much for letting me know. Ingrid Maricela Flores Ramirez. No, she is in Irma Adriana Segura Araujo. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, what about Jesus Eduardo Escobar Carranza? Hello, Jesus. No? Okay. Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Nice to have you one more time. Juan David Madrid Melendez. Present teacher. Perfect. Catherine Jaminet Rivera Callejas. No, she isn't. Kevin Flores Barrera. Kevin Josias Flores Barrera. No, she isn't. Lucia Elena Cepeda de Herrera. I will take the chat later, okay? Just give me, give me some. Thank you. Melvin Ernesto Diaz Corea. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Nice to have you again. Merin Daniela Carranza, Valencia. Present teacher. Wonderful. Nice to have you. Milagro de la Paz, Jimenez. Quintanilla. I'm here. I'm here. Wonderful. Nice to have you. Mirna, Janet, Landos de Luna. I'm here, teacher. Wonderful. Welcome. Nice to have you. Nelson, Adán, Cerón, Medina. He isn't. What about Patricia Esmeralda Garcia Funes? I'm here, teacher. Welcome. Nice to have you. Patricia Margarita Castellanos de Mateo. No, she isn't. What about Ronald Alexis Martinez Flores? Here, teacher. Thank you so much. Roxana Elizabeth Diaz Rivera. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. Sandra Elizabeth Asensio Gonzalez. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. And Sandra Elizabeth Rivas Portillo. Here, Wonderful. It's nice to have you. Uh, one more time. Just let me check the chat really quick. Uh, Lucia. Thank you, Lucia. I'm sorry. Okay, uh, Cepeda, right. Thank you. I got you here. Um, Emilio, thank you. And Ingrid, okay, Ingrid and Emilio. Yes, just give me a minute. Okie dokie. And uh, oh, Jesus, I forgot. Okay, let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Uh, Ingrid, okay. Ingrid and Heaven. Okay, give me a minute. Jesus, Ingrid, okay, Ingrid and Hebel as well. Hebel, what is Hebel? I don't find you, Hebel. Oh, yes, I got you here. Let me check if there is one more here. Uh, okay, thank you so much. I'm sorry for that. Let's carry on on this one. We're going to have this short information about United States, okay, and also Canada, okay? Let me hear Patricia Esmeralda Garcia. Please read this information. Okay. Every year, millions of people in the United States and Canada go camping. Many bring tents and sleeping bags and go to a park campsite. Some go to quiet um, wilderness. <laughs> areas with with few people. Others go to private campgrounds. Most people say they come to the away from everything and everyone, but this is not always possible. At popular park parks like Yellowstone National Park and the Grand Canyon. 
you how to make a reservation for a concise month in advance. And then be prepared for traffic jams. jams. At the end, it doesn't sound pretty good, right? Yeah. Like everything at the beginning was quite like, oh, every, every year, millions. But then I hear millions. That's a lot. Okay. Tell me. Um, let me see. Okay. Let me get one, please. Sarai, tell me, what do you understand from this uh, reading? For this information here. Sarai, hello. Hello, Sarai, please tell me. <laughs> Can you participate now? No? Uh, yes or no? Uh, okay, let's work with um, Camilo. Tell me, what do you understand from this, let's say, information about Yellowstone or camping? I think people is going to vacate to to Yellowstone for a vacation to get away from the the how the noise of the city you know and have a relaxed relaxed place and get an enjoy of the nature Have you ever gone camping Camilo? Yeah, I already went to Yellowstone. How was it? Oh, it was a this was a beautiful, beautiful place. Was it crowded? Uh, is it what? Was it crowded? Like was it full of people? Yeah. Yeah, you have to reserve for a, a, lot, a long time after because a lot of people like to go over there. I went like uh, six times in different seasons. This is a beautiful place. This is a beautiful place. What's, what's your favorite? Like, uh, I think all of them, all, 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 all the time. Because you can see the snow and you can see in summertime, you can see everything. And, and the four seasons, when you go in the four seasons there, you see the beauty of the nature. Yes, that is something that like I really like. Um, here in the Sarva, you know, uh, 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 can you cooking in the in the place? Excuse me. Can you cooking in the place? Can I? Okay, I can hear you. Tell me, say it again. Can you uh, cooking? Did you cook in, in this place? place? No, no, no. We have we didn't cook. Uh, we used to have. Uh, we used to take sandwich. Used to take sandwich, you know, but now not a barbecue, nothing about it. If you go to the river, sometimes you can see the fish is there, but you can fish, you can you can get the fish out of there. It's, it's, it's private. You only can see the nature, but you cannot touch it, you cannot eat it, nothing. Yeah. So you scan the, food. The hunting is about it. Excuse me? The hunting is abided. Yeah. You okay. can uh I think you can only hunt just in once like um no say so I don't know if it's three weeks or a month you can hunt. You can do that. And the background in the old people and in the place, what does what they do? <laughs> I can hear you. I, I think I can. Can you repeat it again? Wait. That's a good question, Juan. That's a good question. I, I repeat it. I mean, he's saying like, is if you're not allowed to do all those bunch of stuff, like, what do they, what do people do over there? Like, that's no, <laughs> no, no, you don't. Yeah, that sounds very interesting, right? Like, if you see like. Everything like you mentioned one thing that is very important and you were answering this question that is here. Okay. So we have good things like and we have also bad things when we, when we travel. Yeah. yeah. The, the, the important thing is this story is que Camilo Camilo es pro evidente que el salvadoreño está metido en todo, ¿no? Yeah. <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> everywhere. Yeah. 
Everywhere. Sometimes sometime people, you can do that. You can put your name on the rocks and you can put the date that you were there. That's the only thing you can do. But you can take some pictures only, but you cannot hunt. You cannot uh, fishing. Even you cannot take a shower on the rivers there. Oh, that's no, that's private. That's private. No, that's that's good. I mean, in somehow it's good because that's nature, right? And and sometimes people yeah. like destroy True. nature. Like, yeah, like... because the United States they have a different culture like us. They they care about the nature, you know. They care about that's the nature. That's you don't good. see trash in the all over the place. You can, you don't see trash there. That sounds good. Every, everything is clean. Yeah. Here we go up we go up a touristic place and we get some bunch of garrobos, right? That's what we do. Yeah, okay. Yeah. You know, I, I, I saw a, a video that the, the Salvadorian people in Florida decide to eat the, the garrobos and iguanas in Florida See? and they show the people uh, that native from Florida that you're wasting this nature, you can eat the garrobos and they teach them how to cook cook it. <laughs> really? And it looks delicious, man, but we can do that only in El Salvador in the United no. States. <laughs> <laughs> and the people start to cook and start eating though, you know? <laughs> and there's Camilo. a big iguanas over there. There's yeah, a big there are iguanas. a lot of them. There's there are big, there are great iguanas there. Por eso es prohibido llevar a, a salvadoreños a las islas. A las islas. They, they reproduce. They reproduce. You can put a great. restaurant. That's what they, they want do. Us they barbecues. Reproduce. Thank you so much, Camilo, for sharing oh, that. Okay, my pleasure. Thank you so much. Question for you, um, Irma. Have you ever gone camping? Have you ever gone camping, Irma? No, I haven't. Okay, I'm sorry. Would you like to try? If you have the chance to do it, where would you like to tr to go camping? I would to try fishing. Fishing, that's good. Like here in El Salvador or in another country? In El Salvador. Do you have a specific place that you would like to visit? No. Thank you so much for sharing that, okay? Thank you so much. So again, um, as you may know, every time we go to a place, like that's a lake, if we go camping, if we go hiking, or if we just go swimming, uh, what are the things that you need to take into consideration when you do it? Like, for example, if you go like to El Tunco Beach, right? Let's say, what are the things that you take into consideration like when you go there? So what there's river and I am swimming in the, the, the rivers. Yes, exactly, right? Exactly. That that's true, right? So so we can figure it out. Oh, I need to take this thing. What are the things that you take when you travel, um, Emilio? Let's say you travel to some place, right, here in El Salvador. What are the things that you say, oh, this one I must have it? Emilio? Hello. Okay, let's work with uh, uh, Patricia Esmeralda Garcia. Tell me, Patricia, what are the things that you keep, let's say, in your backpack, right? So whenever you travel, you keep a bunch of things in your backpack. What are those things that you always have with you? Um, <laughs> in my case, I live near the airport international. <laughs> So she likes to eat and and watch the uh, airplane. That's your daughter, right? Yes. Yes, my daughter. Okay. And me. <laughs> okay. Yes. Yeah, but but the question is like when you travel or when you go to a place like I don't know. Uh -huh. Yes. What are uh -huh. the things that you keep, like, and you say, oh, this one I must have it. Yeah. There's 
Excuse me, Milagro. Yes, Thank sorry. you. Go ahead. Yes, I keep... That's a good one. That's a good one. Yeah, that's a good one. But I think like nobody does here like that thing. I mean that that's a good recommendation, Milagro. I guess. Yeah, but nobody nobody does it. Like nobody gets those those things. Like, uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean that is a that that's that's a good thing, right? They should have the first aid kit, right? But but then, like, um, I think like most of us, the only thing that we get is like, I don't know. If if you go to the beach, let's say, uh, Milano, what are the things that you keep? So you when you get there, you everything is set up for you, like. Well, money. <laughs> no, that's the first thing. Yeah, that's the first thing in your pocket. Swimming clothes. Um, what else? Swimming clothes. Yeah. Sweet. Uh huh. Swim. Sweet. Sunscreen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. So don't forget that you need to keep those those things right. So be ready when you like when you plan something. Like if you're going to visit one place, just keep plan everything before, so you can have everything set up for that. Okay. If you work planning, with this one, medication. Exactly, right? Some pills, like acetaminophen, right? Yeah, so let's get some of those because that cures everything. That thing heals okay. everything. So whenever you Thank have... Food. Oh, if that's a good go, If you go camping? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So here we have this vocabulary related to camping equipment, food or drinks, and things you enjoy. Okay, so we have the first one here, camping equipment. We have a backpack. What is another thing that we can have when it comes to camping equipment? A tent. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. Water. Oh, oh, water goes with food and drink or with camping equipment? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, perfect. So water a goes flashlight. here. A flashlight. A flashlight. 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 Oh, flashlight. Flash. Yes. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh, flashlight. Yes. And hamburgers. Oh, it's sleeping bag. Okay, hamburgers. Oh, <laughs> hamburgers and hot dogs, right? Yeah, hamburgers here in the sample, we'll be, we're going to change it to pupusas. Marshmallows. Yeah, yeah pupusas. pupusas. Let's say pupusas, right? Yes. <laughs> Marshmallows. Yes. Marshmallows. Marsh. Okay. Things to enjoy. Yeah, yeah, when we have the fire. Yes. Uh, uh, sleeping bag is bike. camping equipment. I sleep bag and camping equipment. Oh, perfect. Sleeping bag. Very good. Don't forget that because. <laughs> mm -hmm. I sleep in bag. <laughs> a tent teacher. Oh, yes. A tent. We have it here. The, uh, uh -huh. oh, the okay. second one. Okay. What about things, things we enjoy? A flashlight. A a book. A book, yeah. Oh, a book here. Yes. A book, a book enjoy. Yes. A book. Okay. What fishing about here? things to enjoy? Fishing, fishing pole. pole. Oh fishing. Teacher, yes. a, teacher, a book a, 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 is this uh, enjoy? Oh, fishing a book. pole to oh, enjoy. To enjoy is a book. Oh, yes, right. Probably. Yes. A book. That is correct. That is correct one. Instead of having it here, like here. Can I? Yes, that makes sense. Something I keep it maybe is a sweater. I cannot. A worship. Oh, a sweater. Exactly, right? We can have a sweater. Yeah, don't forget that. If you go to a El Pital, that's a sweater. A canoe. Okay. A canoe here. Fishing pole. Fishing pole. Yeah, that's correct. Uh, what else? I think we're we're done with this one, right? Yes. So this is like like pretty much a quick vocabulary that we can get if we do one of these activities, right? Um, the first thing that you <laughs> okay, 
you should always keep in your in your pocket is 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 money, right? As Milagro was saying. Don't forget that huge thing, okay? Uh, but uh, if you go outside, for example, don't forget to bring everything because there are no tienditas over there, right? So you need to keep <laughs> everything with you. So you, you, I mean, there is like no chance to buy something. Yeah, there is no chance to buy something over there. No tiendita. Exactly. There is no tienda Guadalupe over, over there, right? Nothing like that. So, <laughs> Just bring everything and be ready to enjoy. Okay, give me a minute. Some screen. Yes, Daniela, that's right. Okay, give me a minute, please. I'm sorry. Okay, we're going to finish with a little bit of the grammar part. Let's begin with Anna. Hello, Anna. Hello. Thank you. Which one is right? We have two options, right? I'll phone Hello. you tomorrow. Okay. What about the number two? What is the correct one? I'll do it. I, I, uh, I do it later. Exactly. Can you read the full sentence, please? Thank you. I haven't done the shopping yet. I'll do it later. Perfect. Thank you so much. Right. Wonderful. Geraldine, number three. Thank you. I like the sport. Uh, I watch a lot of sport on TV. Perfect, wonderful, that is correct. Great job, right? Let's take a look of the number four, Juan David, thank you. I need some exercise. Um, I think I, I go for a uh, walk. Thank you, one more time, please. I need some exercise. I think I go. I I go for a uh, walk. Thank you. Correct me if I'm wrong. I, I hear I go. Yes, I go. Okay. Thank you. What do you think about it, Camilo? Is this correct? I go or I'll go? In number four. Number four. I need some exercises for a walk. I think I will go. Yes, that is correct. I will, uh, Juan. Okay. Yes, I, I will. Go. It's like, it's I like will you're go. taking a decision. It's like yeah. you're taking a decision and you're like, oh, oh okay. I need to do something I and I will. Okay. okay. Thank you so much. Very good. Yeah. Sarai, number five, Sarai. Um, Jerry is going to buy a new car. He told me last week. Perfect. Thank you so much. Patricia Esmeralda, number six. Okay, and this letter is for Rose. Mm. Ah, three options. This letter is for Rose. I am going to give it to her. Okay, I'm sorry. Just the conversation is happening at the moment, right? Yes. So when it's happening at the moment, you should use future with will. I'll give. Okay, because the decision like or the things you are doing it at the same time. In the moment. Exactly. Mirna, okay. Janet, thank you. Number seven, Mirna. Okay. I do don't, I do don't, don't. We do go and I think this area. Um, area. We do go anything. We do do. Oh, should be going to or will, just to be sure. Mirna, will seven. or going to? Will. Okay, I'm sorry. That is incorrect. The beginning was correct, Mirna, because it's like, are you going to do anything this evening? Yes, I'm going. Ah, okay. Ah, yes, 
I'm going, yes. uh, I'm going to go out with some friends. Okay. Perfect. Wonderful. Okay. And the last one is for you. Yes, that is for you. Let me see. Uh, okay, Milagro. Thank you. The last one, Milagro de La Paz. Thank you. I can't go out with you tomorrow night. Tomorrow night? Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> uh -huh. Tomorrow the, the night. The easiest one is for you. Remember, the easiest one is for you. Yeah, you you you're a bad boy. You always give me. <laughs> Which one is the correct one? <laughs> present simple, present continuous, or future will will. Um, my goodness, I I can decide if it's um, working or I work. Oh, oh, just sure. just pick one. Yeah. Just pick one. Oh, my goodness, um, because I, I'm not sure because. He is um, aware. Uh, well, yeah, I guess I'm working, sir. That is correct. You're right. Yeah, I'm working. Continues. Uh -huh. It's a scheduled it's event a in the future. Mm -hmm. Very okay. good. Thank you so much. That's great. Present continuous is the answer. Okay, people, thank you so much. So we'll finish. Thank you for everything. You did a really nice job. Everything you did was amazing. Thank you for everything. Keep practicing your English, and I hope everything goes well in the future. Thank you. We nice to meet you, sir. Champion. Have a good time. You God do the same, everybody. everybody. It was yes. nice. John Davis, take care, man. Thank right. you. Saludos a todos ahí. Si quieren contactarse conmigo, por favor, no me llamen. Okay. <laughs> John Davis. <laughs> 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 Nos vemos, Camilo. Nice bye, bye. Take care. God bless, everybody. Bye, bye.